Hey there guys, today I'm going to show you how to add a filament calibration in Orca Slicer. Maybe you're trying to calibrate your filament, you're having issues print with certain filaments. This is how to do it. This is just a quick tutorial, so don't hate me if you need a more in-depth one. This is just, I'm trying to make it quick. So step number one is to open Orca Slicer. Obviously, you're probably here already. So click on the calibration tab up here at the very top. See where my mouse is? Calibration. And then what we want to do here is click on temperature. And then what you want to do is choose what type of filament you have, say if it's PLA, and then for your temperature range, all you have to do is look at your filament and usually it'll say it on there. And then what it'll do is you put your range of temperatures here. It goes, this is 230 to 190 Celsius. And then once you're done here, you click OK. And then this is going to be a filament tower, calibration tower. And then it's going to print this and it'll give you a good idea of what's happening with your filament, where the issues are. You can kind of look at some of these different settings in here. We have bridges, uh, maybe dealing with stringing issues in here. But guys, this is how to do a filament calibration in Orca Slicer. Hit me up in the comments if you have any more questions. I use this all the time. The filament tower is great. Please consider subscribing to the channel. I will see you in the next one.